Hello people, welcome to my channel, welcome to another video. This is my video where I'll be giving you my four things in which the Chelsea first team need to do in order to get a result at Stamford Bridge against AFC Bournemouth in the Premier League later on today. So let's get into those four things. The first thing on the list is that we need to take key players out of the game such as Callum Wilson, Josh King, Ryan Fraser, Andrew Sermon, Nathan Ake, Steve Cook, the list goes on. Um, AFC Bournemouth do deserve to be where they are as they've collected 7 points from a possible 9 in their opening 3 Premier League games. They've beaten Cardiff 2-0, they've beat West Ham 2-1 at their own ground and then they got a 2-2 draw against Everton. So they, they have been playing well and they have got some, they have um, picked up some really good results. Um, for me, there's a reason why we need to watch out for Callum Wilson because of his goal against West Ham, that was absolutely superb. The way he collected the ball and ran through their whole midfield and their defence and in the way he just slotted it past the keeper. If we let that happen then I'm sure everyone, everyone watching this and every Chelsea fan in general would be fuming. So we have to watch out because Callum Wilson is a dangerous player and he is a very good striker. So that's the first thing. We need to we need to stay we need to remain solid defensively or we need to take key players out of the game. The second thing is that we need to score early and sustain our attacks. There's a reason why I'm saying this. The reason is because Bournemouth are a very good counter-attacking side and Eddie Howe, has, Eddie Howe does actually know Mauricio Sarri so he will probably know how to um, counter his way of playing or counter his playing style, sorry for stuttering. So um, we do have to score early and sustain our attacks because it's likely that, that Eddie Howe will set his Bournemouth team up to um, frustrate us and make it really difficult for us to get through and really difficult to penetrate their lines. So that's why we need to score early. The third thing is that we really need to make sure that Eden Hazard gets on the ball as much as possible because he has a superb record against Bournemouth. Goals and assists. He has much less assists than he does goals against Bournemouth but he has a superb record against them. So who cares, we just need to get him on the ball because he will most likely tear their defenders apart and he will most likely score a goal. So just get him on the ball. And the fourth and final thing is that this links to the um, second, my second point. We need to take long shots because Bournemouth will most likely set up to frustrate us. I mean, set themselves up to frustrate us. As Eddie Howe does know Maurizio Sarri, he met him when he was at Empoli or when he's managing Empoli in Italy. So um, we need to take long shots, um, and we meet, we need to make sure that they're on target because, like I said, Bournemouth will most likely make it really hard for us to to um, get in between their lines and get into the box. So um, to recap the first thing, take out key players and um, stay 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 solid defensively. Sorry for starting again, I'm tired, forgive me. The second thing is that we need to score early and sustain our attacks. The third thing is that we need to get Eden Hazard on the ball. And the fourth and final thing is that we need to take long shots. And I forgot to mention that includes set pieces, free kicks, and we need including free kicks, throw-ons, well we need to score from throw-ons that is, and um, we need to take long shots from corners if we have to. So say if we have to um, take a short corner and then pass it along the edge of the box, then so be it. As long as it as long as it goes into the box, and as long as the it ends up going into the back of the net, I don't really care. We just need to we need we just need to make the most of our set pieces and take long shots. As an addition to my fourth point. But yeah, that's the end of my video. Let me know what your four things are. Thank you for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe to my channel, and hit the bell notification. That way you'll be you'll stay notified to all things blues the colour TV. Come on you blues and peace. Let's be AFC Bournemouth and get some revenge. Come on you blues.